Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Empress Shay Shay. Um, I'm just switching up my the way I read a little bit. So let me know if you like, guys like in the comment section. Okay. <clears throat> if you guys would like a reading, look down in the description box. You know how to notify me for a um, reading. Okay. So let's go. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit. This is a divine unit, union energy I'm getting. Divine union energy. That's what I'm getting. Okay. Okay. From what I'm seeing is that this person carries conflict everywhere they go. Okay. Five of Wands. This person is heartbroken because this person wanted to take. This person wanted to take this connection to the next level, but. On the other hand, they're like man, man, trying to manipulate the soul connection. And you can't manipulate a soul connection. And this is why, in other words, this person is having fun breaking your heart. But it's also making them heartbroken. You see this, the two, the two of swords? This is what I see in the two of swords. Them playing with you. You know, like, I see this card different, but I see them like playing with you. Like, um, they just, they, they very, they just, there's a lot of conflict involved in this person. You could be dealing with a, a Sagittarius or Aries, okay? And this person, again, is trying to manipulate this soul connection. From what I'm understanding, this person is playing with you because they want you to chase them. And they want to go to the next level with you, but they're not telling you that. Okay, I'm getting that this person is holding a grudge. You may be dealing with the earth sign, three of pentacles. And this person is holding a grudge because they're jealous of you, of, um, of your accomplishments, your worth ethics, okay? You're a hard worker, and they're jealous of your worth ethics. They don't have, from what I'm understanding, they intimidated because they don't have much, but you do. And this person's also trying to walk away from someone that they um, chose over you. Eight of Cups. Okay? That's water energy. I have um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy also. And I have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Look at this. This came up in reverse. This person is getting a karma. This person is getting a karma. Of from the um, from the games that they're playing, they're getting their karma. And their karma, look at this, this came up in reverse, guys. Their karma is not to have money. You, the universe is hitting this person in their pockets because this person loves you, but they're lying about it. And that's Libra, I mean, this is I this earth energy also. They're lying to hurt you from something that happened in the past. And they're lying. That's why they're holding a grudge against you. Look at this. This came up in reverse too. Okay. This person is mean, sneaky. King of Pentacles in reverse. This person is sneaky, mean, hold grudges. Don't give a fuck what come out their mouth. Okay. They very um, rude. They're very harsh with their words. They're very cold. This is what I'm getting from the King of Pentacles in reverse. Also, earth energy. Okay? You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Virgo. Look at this. The four wands. They know that this is a true love situation. They know that you love them and they love you, but they're not acting upon it. They continue to play games and just sit there and watch you. They want to hurt you. I'm not gonna. Um, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm not gonna hold back. I'm gonna tell you how it is. They want to hurt you. 
deliberately. They think it's funny. Look at this. This person's thinking of having a new beginning with you. I have Aquarius energy. I have Scorpio energy. I have Taurus. And I have um, Virgo. Look at this. This person, you could be dealing with a Gemini. Two of Cups. Look at this. The universe is watching this person. The universe has warned this person not to do these things to you. Because you're very spiritual. Whoever I'm speaking to is very spiritual. And they're not ready to live in their truth. They still live in as to what they care what they still living in the energy as to they still um, care about what other people think and they dumb themselves down in order to fit in with family and friends and they're not ready yet to evolve and become whatever the universe is trying to make them become a better person um, push them towards their spirituality, they're not ready for that. You're waiting on someone that's just not ready. Look at this. I can't make this shit up. This Capricorn energy. They still living out their toxic side, their lower vibrational side. This person is not ready to change. This person doesn't want to change. I'm getting two scenarios. I'm getting one person that's lying to you and um, making you think that they want a new beginning with you, but they rather be single. And they rather still have options. And this person's not going to change. Then the other situation, I have a person that owes you an apology that's intimidated by you, that want to come forth, but they playing games. Okay? This is a weird fucking energy. Look at this. They know that you're their wish fulfillment. They already know that. But it's stressful for them to come out of this worldly environment. It's stressful for them to do right. And again, you, it could be a Sagittarius involved also. Look at this. This is my twin flame card. Didn't I tell you guys this was a, a divine union energy? This is a divine union energy, and this person knows that. This person has been playing with you for five years or more. Look at this. This person knows that you have that the universe has illuminated this to you. This person is very passionate about a new beginning. They want to have sex with you. They want to come forth. But they stay in their head because they're stuck. They stuck with whatever decision they made in the past. Okay? They're trying to go within. They need to go within. It's Virgo energy. And one of, one of these persons, like I said, it's two stories. One of these persons really do want victory and success with you. But they're just not saying it. So, guys, take the message as it resonates. It's two stories here. Someone is moving, coming forth towards you. That's Scorpio energy. And they want a reconciliation. And they in regret for what they did, and they know they owe you an apology. Didn't I just tell you this is Taurus energy? This is a very spiritual connection. Uh, this person may be dealing with the government. I'm hearing maybe dealing with a government check. Or may have some type of situation involving the government. But this person, on the flip side, the other the other situation, this person may still be married with the person that they chose, but they chose the wrong person, and they're in a lot of regret, and they're in a lot of pain, and they're hurting behind it, and they're very unhappy. But they walk around like they're so happy and they're so secure, but even the person that they 
chose wrong for, they fucking around on that person also. So, guys, take the message as it resonates. This is what's like two different stories. This this energy is weird. I'm just letting you guys know. Um, like, share, and subscribe. This is a general message. Um, just take it how it resonates, guys. Light and love.